topic for this session here, we will be looking at cloud computing. And the topic for the session will be, in this case, cloud or on-premise. I know this is something that is lingering on everybody's mind. When we're talking about the cloud, when we're looking at the situation that we are sitting on, and this session is motivated specifically because everybody is looking at options. And mainly the options that people are looking at is that, how do I do my investment on ICT infrastructure? And investment in ICT infrastructure in this case, being driven by either one has to build real estate, and we have got brick and mortar, and we have got shiny metal in your data center to drive your business. Or alternatively, you're looking at, I'm just getting the services. Either the services in this case being ICT infrastructure services that you require, or you want an end-to-end -end where you just need a complete solution. So these are the realities of today. And the stat says most companies in South Africa already have got cloud in their strategy. And we saw that 40% because of the pandemic accelerated their move on those strategies. So I think maybe from offense, if you can highlight what were those peak that you saw that could contribute to this 40% of adoption during the lockdown. Certainly some of the larger projects that I worked on, and particularly at the beginning of the lockdown was around how do we empower our customers to find ways to work and continue kind of on this business continuity spectrum and be able to collaborate and be productive. And Microsoft Teams was one of the tools that we were using there. Um, and I also just want to add that I don't often see it as there's kind of like this linear move of a move from on-prem to cloud. I think that reverse is also equally as valuable, right? So building in the cloud, but building for on-prem, right? And using the tools, perhaps some of the development tools that are available to you on the cloud, you will to rapidly build, but still with the intention of deploying on-prem. So I think this kind of distinction of uh, cloud versus on-prem is not always useful. I think that the thinking around this hybrid infrastructure probably makes a lot more sense and I've seen as a lot of value to our customers.